Destiny posted the live stream uh, they talked to her on. If you want more context, go watch that. Yeah, he her. Stupid. Yo, that nigga went in. I'm, but granted, he asked real questions. Yeah. Why this? Why that? Why are you doing this? And it's apparent what sh- the real motive is, but that's all I'll say. Yeah, shout yeah. out to Destiny, man. Shout out to Destiny, man. Uh, and, 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 you know what's funny? Yeah. He's not, he's not even my friend. Imagine that. Well, we had his back, and he got ours, man. I mean, and te- bro, integrity integrity speaks volumes, guys. And here's the thing, too. Ask a lot of these YouTubers that have worked with us in the past, what do they always fucking say? Yo, Fresh Fit are cool guys. Mm. They ain't going to backstab you. They, 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 they're they loyal. Like, that's just what we how we move. Like, And it's crazy to me how... I, I get criticized. We get criticized for, oh, well, you guys are loyal to people who are your friends, etc. Look at it paying it back back in di- dividends. Right? Yeah. Like, Destiny don't agree with us. He didn't have to do that, but he fucking shut on her anyway. It was fucking fantastic. It was awesome. <laughs> so fucking, it was fantastic. Go to his channel, man. But yeah, go check it out, man. But like, the point I'm yeah. trying to make is, is that people respect that trait. For all you idiots out there that sit there and say, man, you're loyal to a fault. Bro, it always comes back around positively when you do good to people, man. Yeah. When you do good to people, then you're not a piece of shit. Right, and you're and you don't sit there and you backbite them and attack them when they're down and everything else like that, or trying to get a gotcha moment or any of this other crap. They fucking respect you for that shit, especially in this in this realm in YouTube where everyone's a fucking snake, bro. People are real snakes out here. Yeah, like preying on your fucking downfall every day. There's people preying on us, like going down. People laugh when we got demonetized. People laugh when we get uh, when anything bad happens to us, etc. But we're still fucking here. And isn't it funny? People are like, oh, we I, we call Fresh and Fit for comment. You didn't call us. You just made a video. Who said that? Uh, I'm not gonna really? say who. I'm not gonna say who. But they made a video, and it's like, all right, cool. I see you, bro. I see how it is. I see how it is. I'm gonna stay quiet, but I won't forget. Actually, hashtag still over there. Okay. There you go. Damn, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. It's crazy, bro. man. People come out the woodwork, man, and it's wild because it's it's funny. It's like if you make a hippie on Fresh and Fit, you're gonna get like a bunch of views because these people can't garner views with, without it, bro. They really can't garner views without it. It's crazy. Hello? Um, WRDDA goes Fresh did you see Bar- Bernard uh, Riley yeah. Oh okay Alright Walter that man in front of you Is a true friend The man is defending you Left and right after tonight's shows I want to take the man And go buy him an ice cream And get him a nice balloon oh, That's from Punisher I appreciate that bro I mean You know It really bothers me When people talk shit About my friends bro Like I don't get it Like it really does Fucking piss me off When the t- when the Andrew Tate Allegations came out Fucking piss me off um, oh, When shit. people talk shit About Fresh Gets me fucking mad. When people talk shit about Sneeko, etc. If you're my friend, you're my friend. I'm with you regardless of whether it's convenient or not. You fucking pussies in the chat that say, you're married, you're loyal to a fault. Shut the fuck up. That does not exist in my fucking vocabulary, loyal to a fault. Because you're loyal regardless. The whole definition of loyal is being loyal and sticking by somebody, whether it's convenient or not, to fucking be there. I don't believe in this term, loyal to a fault. Okay? And if the fault is death, dad, guess what? I die with a fucking spine. A lot of you motherfuckers are jellyfish. No fucking spine. And that's the reason why a lot of you motherfuckers are fat, triple chin, neck bearded, pieces of shit, fucking dorks with no money, and no one fucking respects you because you motherfuckers don't stand for nothing. If I stand with fresh, I die with fresh. It is what it is. Okay? It is what it is, you motherfuckers. Oh, shit. It's getting shaky. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave. I got 20... Fucking real estate properties so I can tell motherfuckers, fuck you. My net worth is over six fucking million. I get money residually. I don't fucking need to do this shit and I don't need to fucking sell my soul. I stand with my fucking friends, period. All right? Some of you motherfuckers need to get a fucking spawn, you jellyfish SpongeBob in a fucking pineapple house. Pieces of shit. It pisses me off how soft all you motherfuckers are, bro. It's ridiculous. You motherfuckers haven't stepped in the gym in three weeks trying to tell me how to fucking be loyal to my fucking friends. I'm not going anywhere. All right? I'm tired of you motherfuckers. Leave Fresh. Leave Fresh. He's only dead. He's only dead. Well, fuck you. All right? I don't need to make a fucking cent off this fucking podcast. I'm fine. My real estate will take care of me. Because I knew that if I want to say what the fuck I want to say and not sell my soul, I need to go ahead and build residual income coming in every fucking month so I can sit here and tell you fucking haters, fuck you. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to say what the fuck I want to say and I don't give a fuck what anybody got to say. I cannot be bought. I have my soul. I have my spine. I have my integrity. I got my 10 toes and my two feet and I fucking stand where the fuck I'm going to stand and if I die there, I'll die there with a smile on my face because I can look in the fucking mirror and be happy with the man that I see. You pussy motherfuckers. You fucking losers that sit there and say, Oh, it's getting rocky, Myron. You should leave. Why do you stay by Sneeko? Do you stay by the Tate? Do you still think they're having Trump Chris? Fresh is an idiot. Why are you still there? Chris drinks too much. Hey, 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 shut the fuck up. That's why no one respects you motherfuckers. Because you don't stand for anything. If there's anything you guys can learn from this fucking podcast, learn this. 
We've been through hell together. We had people come at us. We've had death threats at us. People will fucking laugh at every time we fucking go through some bullshit. People make allegations on us. People have tried to absolutely fucking destroy us. And you know who was around me the whole fucking time? These fucking guys. So you motherfuckers can say whatever the fuck you want to say. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to stand by the guys that stand by me. Because you fucking pieces of shit aren't fucking there when I'm going through it. You pieces of shit aren't fucking there when I'm fucking figuring out what the fuck I'm going to do. Because we got demonetized. You motherfuckers weren't there when everyone and their fucking mom came at us. You motherfuckers weren't there when I got the false accusation against me. You motherfuckers weren't there when this bitch lied and said that I got her pregnant when I fucking did it. And then you dumbasses, three years later, believe some bitch that makes the same fucking allegations again. You fucking idiots. I'm not going anywhere. I'm standing right fucking here. All right? These guys were with me in my darkest times. I'm not going to fucking leave them in their darkest times. Fuck you, motherfuckers. I got my real estate. I got my money. I'm fine. I'm not going anywhere. I can't be bought. That was real. That was real talk. From the heart. Um, w, w. Myron. Uh, you broke the glass. And maybe the TV. Okay. Um... That was uh, from the heart. Any more chats here before we close out? I mean, that's real talk, man. That's, that's, that's a real friend, man, because uh, when he went through it, we were here. When I go through it, he's here, too. So it's like, let's load to man.